the same thing. And uh, today we're going to be describing some more pictures in history. So we started this yesterday um, and we described a few pictures. Today we're just going to continue and describe some new pictures. So who else has joined us? Hi, Muscab. Did I say your name right? Hello. Oh, uh, click your microphone. Hi, my teacher. Hi, can you pull your microphone away from your mouth a little? It's my microphone? Yes, it's very loud. So if you just pull it away so it's, you know, like here, it should be better. No, it's okay. Yeah, that's better. Okay. Uh, sorry, what's your okay. name? Yeah, it's okay. Good. And what's your name? My name is Musab. Uh, Abdul Qadim. And where are you from? I am from Somalia. Ah, cool. Great. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. And is it Bako or Bacho? Yeah, Basha. Sorry, can you say it again? Basha, Basha. Basha. Where are you from? I'm from Italy. Okay, nice to meet you. Sorry, um, someone's using the blender. It's very loud. Yeah. Um, no problem. You're from Italy. Nice to meet you. Welcome. Thank you. Okay, so I'm just going to put this up on my screen. Uh, like I said, we're continuing from yesterday, and you're just describing some pictures um, in history, some historical pictures. So all you have to do is look and tell me what you see, and I'll help you with your vocabulary. So the first one is about farm life. Um, Alexander. Yep. Do you think you could start us off? You've got three little ones here, um, so you can you can describe all three. Okay. So in the first one, we can see uh, a woman who is feeding uh, little cows. Uh, I don't know how it's ba baby cow <laughs> in English. Calves, baby cow. Calves. Okay. Um, yeah. So um, she has a stick in her hand and. Uh, mm, a bean in, in the other hand uh, uh, with a foot. So, yeah, it's either, I would call it a bucket or a pail. Yeah, okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Yeah, she, she's wearing a dress and a hat. Mm -hmm. yeah. And do you know what this is called, the white thing on her dress, over her dress? Uh, no, I don't. It's an apron. So she's also wearing an apron. You wear them when you're cooking. Or, you know, so your clothes don't get ruined. Okay, I see. Okay. And where are they? Um, they're somewhere in the field. Yeah, in, in a field. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. How about the second picture? Um, the second picture, we can see uh, a woman uh, who is um, baking bread, I guess. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah, so we can see the oven, and she's uh, taking the bread out of it. Mm -hmm. It's um, um, I don't. It's uh, I don't know how to say it, but it, the fuel of the oven is wood. Yeah, so that's right. You can use um, she's fueling the oven with wood, or you can say it's a wood burning stove. Uh huh. Oh yeah, it's tough, right? And she's, do you know what this tool is called that she's using to pull out the bread? Uh, no, it looks like some kind of a shovel. Yeah, it's like a paddle. Uh-huh, okay. She's using a paddle to, to pull out the bread. Good. Um, it, I think it's the same woman, right? Probably. <laughs> it seems so. Mm -hmm. Good. And how about in the third picture? Um, and in the third picture... Um, I'm not sure how uh, how to say it in English, but she's uh, gathering the milk from the cow. <laughs> yeah, could you actually we use the verb the word milk as a verb. She's oh, milking okay. a she's cow. Uh -huh. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. 
Yeah, so uh, we can see she has uh, another uh, bucket with milk and some kind of a cup uh, in, in, a, in one hand, uh, just, uh, you know, uh, so, so it is uh, convenient uh, to milk the cow. Mm -hmm. And then she just uh, uh, transfers milk from the cup to the bucket. Yeah, exactly. Good. Um, also, the part of the cow that you have to touch to milk it, it's called the udder. Like this. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, just another word. Um, and where are they in this picture? Um, they're in some kind of... Um, it's, a, it's on a farm where the animals yeah. uh, live. Uh-huh. You know what it's called? Uh, nope. It's a barn. Barn, okay. Right in the barn. Usually uh -huh. barns are like red and really pretty big. Yeah. Uh-huh, okay. Uh, you could also say they're in one, they're in a stall in the barn. Like each individual place for animals are called stalls. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. Do you know what's on the ground? Um, I'm just answering Patricia. Uh, it's okay. usually yellow, kind of orange. Yeah, it's some, some kind of a dried grass or something. Yeah, yeah, exactly. We call it hay or straw. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. uh, it's synonyms. They're both the same thing, really. Okay. Uh, okay, very good. Excellent job. Um, does anyone have any questions about these pictures or about the vocabulary? No? Okay. Um, great. Let's go to another one. Okay. This is Pioneers, Pioneer Family. <laughs> um, so, Basho, it's your turn. Basho? Uh, you're muted. Click your microphone. You're talking on the phone. Okay, I'll come back. Don't worry. Um, it's okay. Um, Muscab. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Okay. Are you ready? <laughs> yes, I'm ready. What do you see? What do you? I see. I see. I see. I I see two two car two cow mm -hmm. two cow. Do you know what a, a cow um, that's a boy? What we call them with these horns? Okay. I Does see, anyone uh, know the name? Ah, I bull. see two bulls. Two two bull two bulls. Mm -hmm. Okay. Good. What else? I see an um, off. Uh, I see in. I don't understand in our, in English. I see in in drive for one drive for. Mhm. Mm Good. And, and and woman. Mm -hmm. And and one man, and one man is in from the. Um, yeah, exactly. Um, um, do you know what this yes. is called? This big thing. <laughs> okay. It's called a carriage. Yes, carriage. So you can say um, he's in front of the carriage. C carriage. Mm -hmm. Okay, car carriage. Good. Mm hmm. And where are they? Could you repeat that? Where are they? What is this scenery? Yes. Are are they in are they in? Mm -hmm. You would say they are in. They are in they are in the in the in the car carriage. Good. They are in the carriage. And where is this man? Is this man? And is 
this man. Mm -hmm. yeah, this man. This man inside is in. Side is in. Side in the. Yeah, good. In in the, in the sand, um, <laughs> and the water. Right? There's some water. And the, and Mm -hmm. Very good. Yes. And what are these back here in the background? They're usually green. <laughs> yes. You can say there are lots of trees in the background. Trees. Lot of trees. Mm -hmm trees in the background. Okay, great job. Very good. Um, does any, <laughs> anyone have any questions about this picture? Some vocabulary? Um, Hi, Sami. I'll, I'll just say the, the cover in, uh, of the carriage. Yeah, so you can call it just a carriage or you can call it a covered wagon. Oh, yeah. A covered wagon. Um, if you're talking about it as a carriage, mm -hmm. mm, we don't usually say covered carriage. We we I would say covered wagon. It's a covered oh. wagon. Um, and the woman, she's the passenger, right? Yes. Uh, the boy is the driver. Uh, what are these called that move the carriage? Wheels. Wheels. <laughs> It has like big. What are they made of? Made of wood. Yeah, big wooden wheels. Wood turns into wooden when it's an adjective. Big wooden. Oops. Wheels. Um, and he's not wearing any shoes, right? No shoes. Uh, no. Do you know no, what we I'm... call this? There's a word for no shoes. Barefooted. There you go. He's barefoot. Yeah. Or he's got bare feet. They're both fine. Uh, what is he holding? He's holding oh. two things. Ocean. Mm, a rifle. Yes, he's got a rifle. And uh, another thing is, I don't know. The other thing is to snap at the bulls like this. Mm. If they're not moving fast enough, he goes. Oh, yeah. Do you know what it's called? Mm. It's a whip. A whip. A whip. A whip. Yeah. And whip is also the verb. So he uses his whip to whip the bulls. Oh. <laughs> yeah. It works as a verb and a noun. Um, the bulls is a male. Yeah. Exactly. Mhm. Mm you can tell by their big horns. Mm. Okay. Great. Uh, let's go to the next one. Oh, we did the Titanic last time <laughs> and the Vikings. Ooh, under the sea. This is kind of cool. Get a little bigger. Okay. Under oh. the sea. And this one is for um, Basho. Are you back? I think he's still on the phone. Oh, no. Yeah, 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 I'm back. You're back. Okay. Um, so tell me, what do you see? I see many fish mm -hmm. and people in the water. Do you know what they're doing? Yeah, people, people. What are they doing? Um, they want to kill all fish in the water. They want to do what? Kill. Yeah, they're trying to kill the fish. They're yeah. using something specific. Are you using, I don't know what the name is. It's called a spear. Okay, yeah, so yeah. People are spear fishing. They're yeah, spear yeah. I don't know a name, and now I know. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, and I see, I don't, I see why. What, uh, uh, it might be a harpoon too. They could be harpoon fishing. Harpoon fishing. 
Um, okay, and what are they wearing? Where, what, what, again, please? What are they wearing? Their clothing. Wearing? Yeah, on their bodies, their clothes. I, um, um, I don't think. Does anyone know what they're wearing? No. It's a scuba diving. Yeah, good. Scoop, so you can see? Scuba yeah. gear. Scuba diving. Or scuba diving. Yeah, spear fish. Spear. Spear. Yeah. Spear yeah. Yeah. On their feet, they have flippers. Mm -hmm. On their eyes, they have goggles. Um, on their back, they have an oxygen, oxygen tank. This. Um, have a weigh bell you can weigh. Yeah, good. They've got a waistband or a belt. Um, and they all have a bathing suit too, right? <laughs> a bathing suit or a swimsuit. Um, do you know the names of any of these fish? Mm, there is a shark in the middle. Yes, there's a shark. And what about you, Basho? Basho? Oh, he's gone. <laughs> okay, everybody. We, we've got a shark. What else? And tuna. Tuna, good. These ones, I think, are tuna. Tuna are big fish. Mm hmm. How do you say the ship in the bottom of the ocean? Good. Um, it's called a shipwreck. 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 So there's a shipwreck at the bottom of the ocean. A shipwreck. Mm -hmm. Great. Um, now, I don't really know what this is for. <laughs> like pot or something here. Um, yeah, lots of different kinds of fish. I don't know all of their names. The really little ones, these little baby fish, they're called minnows. They're like tiny little fish. Minnows. fish. Yeah. Um, good. Great. Okay. Let's go on to another picture. Ooh, the Mayan temple. Oh, so this one's kind of cool. Uh, and Summing, it's your turn. Okay. What do you see? I see um, two, uh, two men. They um, are playing a uh, butterfly. I look like a butterfly. Yeah, I think so. It's, it's a butterfly, a... yeah. Yeah. This man has a um, um, neck, necklace, mm -hmm. and and then another man is um, very interested in his um, butterflies and pay the attention at it. And the man with a necklace and with a, I think it's a, I am. Like a teeth of an animal, mm -hmm. and have from um, a rope and uh, arrow. A rope. Rope. It's, oh, it's right here. Rope. Yeah, an arrow. Ah, bow, bow and oh, arrow. A rope, bow and arrow. Mm -hmm. And and the four is uh, made of stone, and they have um. Uh, three statue, statue, statue. A statue, yeah. Yeah, think of it. it the word like it. There's a ch in the middle. Statue, oh. statue, statue. Perfect. Um, one is a lock. Nine is a, um, a human statue. They dance on the floor. Another one is a like a. Uh, it's uh, echoes, I would say. The Echo? 
Oh uh, yeah, yeah, echoes. And and uh, in the and uh, fast way, this and have a uh, another statue that is a um, stand up. Uh, another statue that is standing. Is standing and um, the background is a uh, uh, huge temple. Uh, I think it's a pyramid. Pyramid, not Some a temple. Some type of pyramid, yeah. Oh yeah. And it's not uh, like the pyramids that we know, but it's still like a pyramid, right? Oh, with um with steps. But with steps. Mm -hmm. They have um, lots of um, human is uh, uh, walking up um, on the steps to the top, and then have um, lots of people in the in the grounds. They look like is um, working mm -hmm. you know, for for their king, mm -hmm. and have um, many structure. Uh, in the in the far ways, and I think in the I you think can say the, um, I, many structures uh, far in, in the background. Oh, uh, far is the in the background, yeah. Yeah. And uh, and the weather is sunny day because I have uh, seen a shadow. Yeah, yeah, very good. There's some shadows here and here. Yeah. So. Um, I think finished. That's all. Thank you. Great. Uh, do you know what the little boys are wearing here? Uh, it's uh, there is some um, uh underwear. Of <laughs> 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 this, yeah. Yeah, it's called a loincloth. Oh, oh loincloth. Yeah. <laughs> oh, like the like the Japanese. Yeah, people don't wear them very often anymore. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. Very good. Um, and what is their hair? What does their hair look like? It's mm, the hair is look like is um, uh, Do you know um, what it's called? How to, I thought how to say it. you teach me. Please. It's in a ponytail. Oops. Ponytail. Ponytail. Sorry. A ponytail. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> a ponytail. Mm -hmm. Um, okay, very good. Uh, any questions about the picture or the vocabulary, everybody? No? Okay, let's go on to another one for Alexander. Ooh, you get a cool one. <laughs> okay. All right, so. Aztec warriors. I think it's better uh, a bit closer. Okay, go ahead. What do you see? So I see two men uh, and fighting each other. Um, they're wearing some special costumes. I guess it has some, you know, religious uh, meaning or something like that. Mm -hmm. um, so I guess it is a sword in uh, the left man's hand, uh, and he has a shield too. Mm -hmm. uh, It's weird enough that he has a tail. <laughs> <laughs> well, what is he wearing? Um, like, what is this? I don't know, some kind of a costume. Yeah, it's like um, a bodysuit. Uh -huh. A bodysuit. It's like, I think it's a cheetah, maybe? Yeah, it looks like... Cheetah bodysuit. <laughs> it's kind of ridiculous. <laughs> okay, good. What yeah. else do you see? Um, so we can see, uh, you know, some spectators uh, in the background, mm -hmm. and uh, the second guy is, um, I don't know if, if he's attached to that big thing, in, you know, in the bottom of the picture. Ah, uh, yes. I'm just going to go down so you can uh, see. Yeah. Okay, yes. Yeah, so I guess uh, he's... I don't know, maybe some kind of a criminal, so it is made so he just uh, wouldn't run away. Mm -hmm. And uh, I guess it's, you know, some kind of a medieval justice, so fight uh, for your life. If you win, uh, then you're innocent, and if you die, then you die. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. Um, 
Ah, they have loincloths too, actually. Yeah. Mm. And what's going on with their heads? What is all this? Um, on top yeah. of... Mm, some kind of a camouflage. <laughs> yeah, maybe. <laughs> it's like um, either a helmet or a hat. Um, this one is a helmet. Yeah. So like a hard hat, right? They're, it's called a... I'm just going to type it. Uh -huh. um, and what are these decorative things that come off of a bird on the hat? These things decorating. Do you know what they're called? Uh, I can't remember. Yeah, I knew that. Somebody. Anybody? Does anyone know that word? They're on birds. No? Feathers. Feathers. Yeah, right. Yeah, lots of feathers, actually. Oh, in this picture. Mm -hmm. There it is. Yeah. Good. It's an interesting picture. <laughs> yeah, it's like um, the fight for your life, or a duel. A duel. Mm -hmm. um, okay, very good. Uh, does anyone have any questions about the picture, the vocabulary? Mm, uh, one more thing. What are they wearing on their feet? Um... I don't know, it's some kind of shoes, but they're, they have no, uh, you know, no, no front cover. <laughs> yeah, we wear them in the summer. Slippers. No, slippers, slippers are for inside, uh -huh. like to keep your feet warm. Can I? Yeah, I think. Sandal. Yeah, sandals. Yeah, oh, sandals. Okay. They're like summer shoes, <laughs> sort of. Okay, very good. Um, let's go to another picture. Okay, we have some explorers in the Wild West, it says. Um, so, uh, let's see, Muscab, it's your turn. Yes. So, what yes. do you see? I think I'm going to go a little bit closer, so there's just two. Uh, it's easier to see. Okay, so... Yes, I see. I am not see. No, yes, I, no, yes, I am see now. Okay. And I see. And two, and two horses. Horses. And, uh, yeah. four, and three, three horses. Mm hmm so you would um, say uh, three horses. Yes, horse. Yes. Mm -hmm. And 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 three and three man three men and and offer the horse. Mm -hmm. And. And three, um, three, uh, t t three men, um, three men is in, is is the in, in the in the. Yeah, what are they doing? In, in the wall. Three men, uh, three three men. Mm -hmm. uh, it's just that. Uh, She's walking. They walk in. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Um, this walk. man has a map, a map in his hands here. He has a map, and he's looking. So, what do you think they're doing? Okay. Yeah. What are they? What? What? Are they doing? Where are they going? They're doing in, in, in eating in the horse and mm -hmm. grass. Yeah, this grass, this horse is eating grass. Good. Mm, and Muscab, what do you see in the background? Back here. In background, my background. 
Mm -hmm. Could you repeat that? Yeah, what... I'm going to type, what do you see in the background? background. Yeah, yes. like behind I, that. I, 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 I see three. Mm -hmm. Trees. Mm -hmm. Yes, trees, grows. Mm -hmm. Three horse. Yeah, and what are these big things here? Mm, starts with an M. Mao. Does anyone know this word? Mountain. Yeah, mountains. Yes, uh, mountains. mountains. Mm -hmm. And some rocks. And some rocks. These ones over here. Uh, peak. Rocks. A peak. Sorry? Peak. Peak? Can you type it? Peak. Ah, yes. The peak of the mountain. Good. Mm -hmm. The peak is the very top up here. Um, okay. Very good. Great job, Ms. Scott. Does anyone have uh, any questions about vocabulary? There's a lot of things here. <laughs> Um, yeah, how, how do you call uh, those things uh, the man in the front wearing with, uh, you know? Ah, yes. Um, it's called a fringe. So you uh -huh. can see um, he's wearing an outfit covered in a fringe. It's got lots of a fringe all over it. Big fringe. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, they've got some crazy outfits. <laughs> What about this guy over here? I'm going to zoom in. Hold on. Okay, here we go. There's two two men here. What is the man wearing who is standing? Wearing. Anybody. Anyone can answer. A coat. Something? A coat? Yeah, some sort of some sort of coat or jacket. Mm -hmm. What else? What's on his Very. head? Uh, it's a hat. Yeah, it's a certain kind of hat. Called a top hat. Wearing a top hat. Mm -hmm. And what is he leaning on right here? Uh, his rifle. Yes, you can say he's leaning, leaning on a rifle. Um, okay, very good. Yeah, zoom out. And um, Patricia, if if you're ever able to speak, just tell me, okay? <laughs> okay. Um, summing. Let's find one for you. Okay. Oh, it's empty. <laughs> okay. Ah, the gold rush. Okay. Another one. Um. Uh, okay. There's uh, the the first picture. Mm -hmm. There, there are female. Uh, what uh, one is uh, sitting on a rock and handing a stick. Mm -hmm. Another one is um, uh, using uh, uh, that is. Uh, Using equipment to to ca to to catch some uh walk sands a metal from the river. Yeah, very good. So mm -hmm. this activity it's called panning for gold. Oh, panning for gold. So he's he's using a pan to get gold from the river, oh, and the yeah. verb is to pan. Panning for gold. Oops. Yeah. So equipment is uh, called a pan. Yeah, exactly. Just like a pan that you use to cook. It's okay. the same word. Yeah. Uh, he's um, panning uh, for gold. Mm -hmm. And other men behind him, he's um, 
He is uh, handing a, uh, is an a deck. Is it a deck? Deck. Yeah. And talking something. This man who is standing. Yeah, he is standing and. Uh, it's um, it's not a stick. Look at the end. Deck. Is it deck? Or. There's or some. What? This metal, I go. How is yeah. it? He uses it to dig. Yeah, it's to dig. Does anyone know what it's called? A shovel. Yeah, it's a shovel. Oh, a shovel. Okay. Mm -hmm. And he is um, talking to the other man. Maybe he says, you don't um, do this. You need to uh, take uh, 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 take um, the show the land uh, to get to go. And they have um, they are have um, a horse. Uh, each is a uh, carriage carrying uh, a baggage. Mm -hmm. And it um, not like it's um, drinking or water from the river. Mm -hmm. And at the and then uh, be uh, behind the horse, they have um, they have uh, two house two house two houses, or um, I think they are cabins. A cabin, cabin, two cabins or cabin. or two log cabins. No, oh, two cabins. Mm -hmm. Two log cabins. And in the second uh, pictures, they also have um, females. They are, they are, uh, is a, they is a pick ass. You see? Very good. Pick axe. Good job. To pack, mm, to pack out mm, the stone. Yeah, and the verb is to mine. Oh, to mine. Oh, okay, yeah, that's mm -hmm. mine. To mine, and um, they want to uh, find out something mm, that uh, uh, is gold or silver, maybe diamond, mm -hmm. and. Uh, and then there's have um, a shovel in the uh, in the river. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, I mm -hmm. I have a I have um, a cement. I just he moved have, it for you. To uh, the yeah, he have a life and um, uh, a gun. Oh, yeah, mm. right here. Oh. Yeah, I can see, um, he has a knife in a yeah. holster on his belt. Oh, in his, oh yeah. This uh, like thing that it sits in, mm. it's called a holster. Okay. Same for okay. guns. You can have a gun in a holster. Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. Um. The first, um, the first, um, practice. Yeah. They have, uh, yeah, they have two men use the, the... Be careful when you say men, it should not be men's. Two men, no S. Oh, okay. Okay. So they have, um, there are two men mm -hmm. uh, use uh, so, so mm -hmm. uh to... Here's a new verb for you to sift. You to separate the the sand, the rocks, uh, from the uh, from the wooden containers yeah. with uh, with water. Mhm. Mm Good. They have um. They are a horse uh, beside a tree. And the horse is um, tight uh, with a uh, with a cheese. Tight. 
tied to the tree. Oh, tied to, to the tree, yeah. Mm -hmm. And have um, I have a yeah, mountain uh, behind a horse, behind the horse. I think it's just a hill. It's not so big. Oh, a hill. Yeah. And there have um, there are there are lots of uh, uh, grasses. Mhm. Mm lots of grass. Yeah, grass. Grass. It's um uncountable. Oh yeah, grass. Mhm. Mm grass. Uh, uh, I think that's pretty much. Yeah. Yeah, um, yeah, does anyone, very good, Samming, excellent. Um, does anyone have any questions about the vocabulary? Anything you see here, you don't know what it's called? No? Okay, um, all right, so let's find another one. Maybe something other than cowboys, yeah? <laughs> ah, Japanese festival. Okay. Let's do this one. Um, uh, Alexander, I think I'll give you two, this one and then the next one so that you have a little bit more to describe. Okay. Is big enough? Uh, how's that? There we go. <laughs> uh -huh. Perfect. Okay. Okay, so we can see some kind of a Japanese festival. I guess it's... Uh, I don't know, maybe some kind of a New Year celebration or something like that. So uh, all the people uh, in the picture are wearing traditional clothing. Uh, I guess it's kimono or something like that. Yeah, very good. Uh, so um, I see men uh, with swords uh, uh, in the holsters. And, um, good job. Good use of the word. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. And uh, women, uh, um, women are holding. Uh, I forget the word. Forget the word. It's uh, uh, fans. Fans, yeah, a Oops. thing to blow uh, some air in your face. Mm -hmm. um, so we can see uh, some kind of a monster in the background. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I guess it's uh, the main the main character of the whole celebration. Mm -hmm. And some people are holding umbrellas. Uh, there, there's a special name for this kind of umbrella, actually. It's called a parasol. Uh huh. Okay. Yeah, and um, we have some fancy building in the background. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, I guess it's a flag on the left. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, there's a couple flags. Good. Um, what are they wearing on their feet? Let's see if you can remember. Uh, I guess uh, they are sandals. Yeah, sandals. Good. Um, and then the thing, the monster, it's actually called, um, it is a monster, you're right, um, but it's called a float. Uh -huh. So anything okay. that you carry like this in a parade or a uh -huh. celebration, we call it a float. Okay. Uh, you could say it's like a monster float or dragon. I don't know what kind of monster it's supposed to be. It's hard to tell. Um, good. Uh, before we go to the next picture, does anyone have any questions about the vocabulary? It's okay. I have one, one question. How, how do yeah. you pronounce uh, kimono? Just like that. Okay. Kimono. Yeah, it's perfect. Uh -huh. Um, okay, let's go down to the next one. So we're still in Japan. <laughs> this time it's uh, a uh, Japanese fisherman. Oh, that's funny. I guess he has uh, some kind of a trained ducks. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> to fish for him, so he's not They're using. pulling his boat, I think, too. Yeah, so he, he he's not using any traditional uh, things to catch fish. Uh, I don't know even uh, what's going on because uh, <laughs> I don't know how, how you can train a bird not to eat a fish <laughs> but to bring it to you. <laughs> I have no idea. And he has some kind of a fancy lantern uh, at the top uh, mm -hmm. of his boat. Uh, 
Yeah, it's, it's um, in a hanging basket. Yeah. Uh, why? What's that for? What do you think? Uh, I guess it's to attract the fish, but uh, I don't know. Maybe maybe just uh, you know, so other uh, fishermen uh, know that he's around. Mhm. Mm yeah. Okay. And what do you see in the background? Uh, I can see some other fishermen, fishermen, and um, we can see a mountain, mm -hmm. quite small though, and we can see a full moon. Yeah, there's a full moon back there, good. So lots yeah. of fishing boats. Um, what is the thing, this wooden thing that he's using uh, to push the boat? Uh, yeah, I don't know how to call it. It's called a paddle. Paddle. Yeah, okay. You can say he's using a paddle, or or you can use it as a verb. He's paddling. Right. Mm -hmm. And is, is there any special uh, name for the boat? Uh, just a fishing boat. Okay. Yeah, yeah, a fishing boat. There's no fancy name. It's kind of uh, kind of looks like a canoe. Um, it's like a canoe, but usually a canoe you don't have all of these fancy things <laughs> like um, it's just the boat and some oars or paddles um, okay. yeah good okay any questions everybody I think it's and funny to have these ducks it's really strange yeah I got one question what's yeah. uh, uh, what's about uh, the man uh, man's hair how do you call it oh, okay uh, his hair is in a bun uh -huh. Okay. In Actually, in this last picture, everybody's hair is in a bun. <laughs> oh, right. <laughs> or a few different buns with like um, chopsticks in their hair. <laughs> okay. Good. Great. Let's see another one. Okay, so now we're back at home. It's not exactly well. Yeah, I guess it's a farm, but. Um, just an old-fashioned looking home. Um, so, Muscab, this one's for you. Yes. Uh, what do you see? Um, one, one man, and uh, one man, and dig and hammer. Yeah, it's not a hammer actually. Um, oh yeah, it is a hammer. Sorry, I thought it was an axe. Yeah, he's using a a big hammer. A big hammer, yes, and uh, and and one woman and daughter in front of uh, the house. Good. They from the house. They're in front yes. of the house. In front of. Yes, and uh, also and. Uh, in of a green and more tree yeah lots of trees i think it's a forest no a forest yes a lot of the tree is a forest yes it's forest mhm mm good mm -hmm. and do you know what this is called around the house. It's wood. This one? No? Anybody? I guess it is the fence. Yeah, yeah. A wooden wooden fence. Fence. Mm -hmm. Good. Um great Muska, very good. Uh, do you guys see anything else? Uh, yeah, I'd like to ask uh, what, uh, how do you call it when uh, a man in the first picture, he's trying to separate a lock into some small pieces. Well, how do you call those pieces? Uh, um, kindling. Okay. So small, there's a difference. Okay, uh, small pieces of wood, like used to start a fire, this is kindling. Uh -huh. um, uh, I guess... Uh, pieces of wood, yeah, to, to keep the fire going. You just call them logs. 
Okay, and uh, what if he's uh, trying to make, uh, you know, new parts for the fence? How do you call it then? Um, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I guess uh, a log for the fence. <laughs> okay. So, um, I'm sure there's there might be a name. Let me look and see. Uh, I want obviously, to, it's not a common word because I don't know it. <laughs> I want to ask mm, the small. Uh, a part of a tree is called is called trunk. Uh, it's called the trunk. Oh, trunk. The tree trunk or the trunk of the tree. Like for this one, you could say there's an axe leaning against the trunk, right? Oh. The trunk. Uh huh. Um, How about the long the first picture? The long, not the long part of the uh, wood. The wood. This part. No, uh, the yeah, the long yeah. It's still yeah. it's it's a it's a log. A log. Yeah, you can have big big logs and small logs. Oh. But it's just the one word. Oh, yeah. log. Mm -hmm. Um. Do you remember what I called a house that looks like this? It's not a house. What's it called? Made out of wood. Um, yeah, ma made made of wood. It's a log something. Starts a log house. No, ca <laughs> cab. Cab. Oh. Log cabin. A log cabin. Cab. Cab. Yeah. Um. A cabin, it's like a very little house that you've built with with wood, usually. Um, okay. Uh, any other questions about this picture? Oh, these little pieces of wood down here, kind of scattered, see the very little pieces? Those are called wood chips. Okay. So when you cut wood, usually there are some little chips, right, lying around. Um, so you call them chips, wood chips. Oh, hammer. Yeah, this one, it's it's actually a, a very big hammer. It's called a mallet. So he's using a mallet. I would say he's using a mallet to separate the log. A log. Log. Mm -hmm. And I think we'll stop there. I think that's it um, for today. But we have some more pictures to describe, and we'll be doing some more of that next week. So um, if you want to remember the vocabulary, I'm just going to copy it for you. Uh, one second. I'm just going to put it in a document for you here. Mm. Almost done. Yes. Okay, here you go. So I just copied and pasted the chat, <laughs> really, um, but it's there for you if you want it. Okay. And thank the you. next class is a games class. We're playing Taboo. After that, uh, we have some writing. So maybe I'll see you there. Okay? okay sure. Bye-bye. Thanks for coming, guys. Bye. See you soon. See you.